Hello again everyone. In this video tutorial we are going to solve this given equation. In order to solve this thing the very first step is I want you to add 120 on both sides. So that's the very first step. So 120 and negative 120 they are gone. Simply we ended up with 64 x power 3 over 4 equals to 125. Now I want you to divide both sides by 64. So this 64 and 64 they are gone. So we ended up with x power 3 over 4 equals to 125 over 64. Now the next step that we want, want to do is we want to get rid of this exponent of this x variable. So the easiest way to get rid of this exponent is to take the power of the reciprocal of this exponent. Reciprocal means the opposite that's going to become 4 over 3. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to see, take the power of 4 over 3. Just the flip it over at this one and I'm going to take the power of 4 over 3 here as well and here is the fact that we will be using now on the left hand side when you have a two exponents like x power m then power n then those exponents you can multiply them out so we have two exponents there's a one exponent and there's another exponent just go ahead and multiply them out. So x power you got 3 over 4 times 4 over 3. So far so good. Equals to, just write it down, 125 over 64 power 4 over 3. Now as you can see that this 4 over 3, 3 cancels out, 4 cancels out. So we simply got an x on the left hand side. And here we can write this one, we can split it up. These two fractions I can write 125 power 4 over 3 divided by 64 power 4 over 3. And by the way, splitting this thing up, we use this fact. If you have a fraction a over b power m, then you can write a power m divided by b power m over here. Before we get started, I want you to look at 125, this part. Isn't it 125 could be written as 5 power 3? That means you multiply 5 3 times, you're going to get 125. And likewise, 64 could be written as 4 power 3. So that means over here, I can replace this 125 and 64 by these numbers with exponent. So I'm going to write down x equal to 100 and 25, 4 over 3, I'm going to leave it like this thing over here, 4 over 3, and I can write 5 power 3 right up here, divided by 64, I can write 4 over 3 here, by the way, this is 3, by the way, and over here in this parenthesis, I can write 4 power Three. So far so good. Now we're gonna go ahead and simplify this stuff. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we have a two exponent. See right now? Whenever you have a two exponent, we can multiply them out. We used that fact just a few minutes ago and likewise in this one as well. So I can write this x equal to 5 power 3 times 4 over 3 divided by 4 power 3 times 4 over 3. So far so good. Now 
you can see this three and three is gone. This three reduces with this three. So pretty much we are ended up with x equal to five power four divided by four power four. So that means five power four is 625 because we multiply five four times and four power four is 256 and that is our solution. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.